Hello there, this is Scott. Today I want to bring to you one of my favorite 118 scale diecast cars. I've got a large collection of these, and I'm going to be bringing some of these to you from time to time. The one I'm showing you right now today is a 1955 T Bird. I'm going to tell you a little about the history of some of this information, so if I pause to look down, you'll see what you'll understand. The Ford Thunderbird is an American automotive icon that was produced first in 1955. During the early 1950s, servicemen were returning back from World War II. Over in Europe, they had fallen in love with MGs, Jaguars, and Triumphs. And the American automotive industry manufacturers felt like they could produce a car in America that would have the market for the small sports car that would be loved by all. The three men responsible for this car was Louis Caruso, Frank Hershey, and George Walker. Now, Caruso was a GM executive, and Walker was a stylist, and Hershey was a designer. Well, they both got together and convinced Hershey to go ahead and come up with designs that would be developed to what you see here, an open two-seater. Isn't this a beautiful car? Now, this particular car was offered in full metal, full metal body. Inside, in the engine compartment here, was the 292 V8 engine offered in 193 or 212 horsepower. Now, if you look here at the dashboard, real close, kind of hard to see, you'll see a tachometer, you'll see a radio, and you'll see a speedometer that goes up to 150 miles an hour. Now, for 1955, whew, that was fast. This was also offered an automatic and manual transmission. Also had a ball, ball joint front suspension that offered a plush ride. Now, this was only offered as a convertible. And it came with this optional hardtop. The hardtop at the time actually had a porthole window in it. Now, the produc production units of this time, back in 1955, was around 16,000 units. This car was first available for the public to see in 1954, as a concept only at the Detroit Auto Show. Then in 1955, when it became available, it just offered slightly from the concept car. Beautiful car. Now, isn't this... A work of art. And I know that you agree with me. And since you do, how would you like to take her for a spin? Now thanks for watching. Stay tuned. There's more cars to come. Be sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.